everybody, this is Praxis, and today I'm going to be laying the last layer of bricks on the chicken coop foundation. Uh, as you can see, I've got the mortar up on this end here, and uh, this is kind of a, well, it's an important, well, they're all important, they're all important, but this is a, a particularly important layer of bricks because this is the last one that I've got before I'm going to be putting the, uh, you know, the sill plate on and actually start the carpentry. So if there are any imperfections in uh, the height, of the foundation wall, I want to try to, to make it as uh, perfect as I can after this. I've been doing this uh, the entire way that I've been going up, uh, you know, making little adjustments here and there if I find some part of the wall is getting a little higher than another. I've been uh, doing tweaks, and I want to talk about what those tweaks are and how I uh, approach them in this video because this is the last time I have a chance to fix anything. So what I did is I uh, took this level here uh, and uh, got it on top of a, a board to uh, kind of get like a, a longer uh, reach on it. And I've gone all over the entire foundation and I tried to find out from the top surface what was the highest point on the entire surface. And it seems like it's right in here somewhere. Uh, this is up a little bit higher and it kind of slopes down just a little and slopes down just a little over there. And as this wall goes off that way, it kind of slopes down a little bit. So right in here, is the, the highest point in the whole foundation. So uh, what I'm planning on doing is I'm going to start setting my bricks in here and I want to push these down into the mortar as deeply as I can so that you know, there's little mortar between them and the uh, uh, layer be uh, beneath them. And uh, then as I go out in each direction, I'll let the, the mortar get just a little bit thicker and thicker as it kind of goes off in uh, you know, either direction. I'll be using the uh, level, uh, which is right behind you here, to kind of check it brick to brick, but this is my last opportunity to try, try to fix things. So, uh, like I said, it's right around here or so. Uh, it's going to correspond to the, the row of bricks uh, below because I'm kind of like staggering them as I go up. So I guess I'll put this corresponding brick in right here. I've got it right over here. And let's, uh, let's set it in. Conditions today are really ideal. We just had rain last night. Everything's nice and moist. We don't have any really hard sun, so it's easy to keep this stuff kind of kind of moist. I'm looking at the levels on the top, trying to keep it nice and straight. I probably put way more mortar here than I needed to, given that I'm trying to keep this nice and thin. Where's my little towel? Okay. I'm going to be scraping this stuff up as I go and putting it ahead where I'm going to be going next. And on the back side, well, it's hard to reach over this. The wall's getting kind of high. Cool. So I got all that, and I'm just uh, paint it, ugh. I'm trying to pay it forward to the next part of the wall, but I'm dropping a bunch of it. Alright, so I'm looking at the uh, balls on the top of here, uh, the little bubbles, and uh, just trying to keep it nice and, uh, na uh, nice and level as I work it down, and I'm listening to see when it starts scraping on the brick below. Alright, I think I'm starting to hear it there. All right. So we'll clear off the last of the excess here. Throw it over there. Same on the other side. All right. Paint it forward. And at this point, I just want to make sure it's nice straight up and down. So I use my fingers to kind of just feel, make sure it's nice and flush. I think I got a bug in my throat. I mean that literally and figuratively. It's all this fluff floating around in the air. I'm inhaling some of it. Alright, cool. So that feels pretty good. You can sight down along, close one eye, look down along the edge, and just make sure it looks like it's nice and flat and straight, and it does. And yay! That's as high as this wall is going to be. So I'm going to kind of continue off in both directions, allowing them to get a little thicker as I go, and uh, judging it based on uh, the level here. <sighs> Getting there. Thanks for watching.